McDougall. They've taken us around the world. We've had some highs and some lows. Join us now as we rebuild our 96 Land Rover Defender to be the ultimate overlanding machine. The first job we had was ripping out all the old setup. As you can see, it's pretty lightweight, which is great, but it just didn't stand up to overlanding. Taking the remaining wiring out, we start the rebuild. While the back was empty, we took the opportunity to cut away the bulkhead. This will make it easier for us to get from the cab to the rear without exiting the vehicle. It will also give us a little more space in the rear. Once the bulkhead is cut away, it's replaced with this bulkhead removal bar. By removing the bulkhead, the rear feels instantly bigger and the access from front to rear is greatly improved. After the back had a good clean, soundproofing was next. We chose to use Dynamite Extreme. Even without the roof done, it sounds significantly quieter in the rear. It took four bulk kits to complete the sides and the floor. To further improve living conditions in Kerman, we fitted Dynaliner insulation. This is a closed cell rubber compound. Being self adhesive makes it super easy to fit. We used half inch on the sides and quarter inch kits on everything below this. The next job was fitting our dash console. Here we had to cut away a section of the current dash. But then we fit the dash console. From here we will control and monitor all of our overland modifications. For now, this marks the end of our interior jobs. Join us in the next episode when we get under the hood. Please remember to subscribe and find us on Facebook and our website.